Hi everyone, welcome to our latest video where we want to share with you the latest Microsoft Teams updates for September. Let's get started with our first update which is scheduled messages for Microsoft Teams chats. Microsoft Teams is introducing a new Schedule Send feature that will allow you to schedule a chat message to be delivered in the future so the recipient can see it at a convenient time for them. To use this new feature, you'll need to right click on the Send button to access the scheduling menu and select a date and time within the next seven days. Compose your message and then select Send and the message will be scheduled to be delivered at the later time. You'll be able to schedule messages on desktop and mobile. This will work similarly on mobile but will be a long hold rather than a right click. All scheduled messages can be edited and deleted before they are delivered. This is due late September to mid-October. Our second update of today is a change of the download location. When downloading files in Microsoft Teams, it automatically uses the downloads folder on your computer. This new feature will allow users to change the location of where your files are saved into. Going into Team Settings and then Files, we can browse other folders that we want to automatically download our files into. There will also be a new toggle that will prompt you for the location for each download. This feature is already rolling out but should be complete by October. Our third update we have for you today is new translated captions during Teams meetings. Subtitles in Teams meetings are originally in the language that they are spoken in. However, this new update is going to allow you to switch languages from the meeting subtitle menu. This feature is already rolling out as well, but should also be complete by October. Our next update is starting a group chat. This new feature will allow us to start Teams chats with groups of people instead of just individuals. Users will be able to use modern Microsoft 365 groups that are used to manage the members of our teams as well as the legacy email distribution lists and security groups too. This new feature will abide with the set limit on members in a group chat which is currently set for 250. This will work on desktop and mobile versions of Teams. This will be significantly helpful for those users still using the email and security groups. This will be rolling out during September and will be completed by the end of October. Our last but not least update is an automatic view of up to 49 videos on Microsoft Teams meetings. Teams meetings currently support a maximum of 9 videos which is 3x3 free free on the default gallery view. For seeing more than 9 videos you would need to manually select the large gallery view. With this new update it will be default to see up to 49 videos on your screen without any user intervention needed. Large gallery and gallery view will still be an option as well. This is due late September to early October. So that is all for today's video. We hope you're excited for these new updates like we are. Make sure you subscribe for more tips and tricks.